Hi, my name is Samir. I'm a clinical pharmacist working in a GP practice. I have a master's degree in pharmacy and also independent prescribing. I specialize in all medicines and safely prescribing these medicines for long-term conditions for patients, specifically those patients with high blood pressure, diabetes and asthma. So, if, tell me, give me an example of somebody that you saw recently. So I recently saw a patient who had just come into the country. Uh, he was recently diagnosed with type 2 diabetes in India. He was still experiencing symptoms of diabetes. He was feeling excessively thirsty, excessively hungry, waking up in the middle of the night, still going to the toilet. Uh, and I just called him in, spoke to him, and just got a real sense of whether or not he's been taking his medication accordingly from India. Found out that he wasn't and just what next steps would be sort of possible to get the best out of treatment and just to help him in his day-to-day -day activities as well. What's the best part of your job? Probably the patient interaction and just seeing how you can help patients from the start of their sort of treatment all the way up until they're maintaining their treatment. And what's the difference between a community pharmacist and a so I think a clinical pharmacist is more involved in the sort of diagnosis and management of that patient and their medicines. Uh, community pharmacy is really good in a sense that they sort of keep on top of the medication in terms of making sure that doses and everything is appropriate. But clinical pharmacist in a GP setting is where you're doing the nitty gritty work.